Hello Sagittarius, welcome to Karina Star Tarot. This is the reading for the whole of the Sagittarius Collective. So take what resonates for you and leave the rest. Please don't forget to drop me a like and subscribe before you leave my channel. Thank you. So I'm going to jump into your reading. I'm using the Royal Gilded Tarot deck and I'll use some angel answers towards the end. Starting off with the King of Swords. So we'll lay the cards out first and then see what they have to tell you. The Tower. We're dealing with Aries. The Star. Could be dealing with Aquarius. The Eight of Pentacles. The Queen of Cups. Strength card. Could be dealing with a Leo. The Wheel of Fortune, you could be dealing with a any fixed sign. Fixed signs are Aquarius, Taurus, Leo and Scorpio. And you've already had two of the fixed signs come out for you, Leo and Aquarius. You've got the Eight of Swords. The Ace of Pentacles. The Seven of Wands. The Three of Swords. And the Two of Pentacles. I feel that some of you are going through a process of healing. You're currently going through this, I feel. Because I feel that you challenges um, getting over and ending something that's fallen apart uh, something that wasn't very stable to begin with something that came crush crushing down but I feel that you may have called time on this that you cut out something that wasn't working out for you Uh, I feel there's could be very sharp words, bitterness exchange, you know, bitter words exchange between you and whoever you're dealing with. Um, yeah, you definitely cut this person out. And you're working on yourself, you know, you're working on putting yourself back together again you know after this um it's been quite a, a major significant ending it's been very stressful and you're trying to get your balance back you're working really hard to get back on track get yourself back on track you feel you need time to work through these emotions to think about this to reflect on this experience um, you may be emotionally all over the place 
or in a very reflective kind of mode here kind of looking back I sense a lot of emotion within you it's it's been a very upsetting experience for you you're you're trying to stay sh you're trying to be strong for yourself you're trying to overcome this ending this has been a very painful ending for you change is coming though You've got the wheel of fortune you're not going to be like this forever there are changes ahead for you but in the meantime you're trying to sort yourself out you know you're, you're working very hard you know you are full of questions then maybe you may feel you may be feeling a bit confused you know doubting yourself thinking where do I go from here unsure of your future perhaps I do see that you know a bit of doubt there you know, you, you've, you've gone, you feel, you're feeling as low as you can feel at the moment. But things are going to pick up, things are going to change. Um, it does indicate here that there is a chance for a new start here. For you to turn this around. For new opportunities to come in for you uh, if you continue to work through these emotions and this pain you know continue to focus on your healing um, then you can start completely fresh because this does indicate there is a new relationship coming in for you but not at this particular time because you need to heal You may have barrier, a barrier up at the moment. Um, you're determined definitely to work through your problems. You're trying to stay strong, but you are not available to anyone emotionally at the moment. Um, there's definitely a sense of, you know, you need your space. You know, you need time to get over the heartache the pain but that's not going to last forever it's going to change like I said you have got the ace of pentacles and the wheel of fortune so that's change coming and it's there's a positive outlook in the meantime you're going from one extreme to another at the moment in your emotions you know um, you have good days and bad days let's get you out just a bit more Let's get some clarification on the Ace of Pentacles. Um, yeah, the Ace of Pentacles, because I want to know what good stuff is coming in for you. Because you're going through it right now, but like I said, there's a change coming, and you have got the Ace of Pentacles. So let's clarify that for you. What the fool? So. It's clarified by the fall, so this definitely does confirm the fact that you got a chance, you know, take the chance to start anew. There is a new beginning in store for you, coming for you. This is Aquarius energy. Aquarius energy is quite strong in your reading, actually. Um, and of course, it is a fixed sign. Um, you've got Leo as well in your energy. Um, and Aries but yeah Aquarius is quite strong so yeah you've got a chance to start afresh it's whether you're ready to take that next step to take that risk whether you want to at the moment you're not in that space but you will be you will be you're getting some 
positive cards out now you know i feel that it's just a matter of taking that time out to heal learning from your experience so that and put it and putting it behind you you know taking on board the lessons that you've learned from that experience showing yourself some self-love self-care and then moving forwards got the world here yeah you've got the world so there's definitely going to be something new for you there's going to be a new relationship coming in for you it may be a while before this happens but i do see there's definitely a new relationship coming in for you it might be a number of months down the line maybe sort of more further on in the year i'd say and you have got temperance that's your own sign so yeah you're going to take it easy you're going to take it slowly you're not going to rush into anything because you want to get your balance back you want to start feeling better within yourself you want to take some time for yourself and once you feel like whole again and happier in your mind and in your heart, then you'll be ready to start something new. But I feel that's when someone new comes in anyway. Because you'll be projecting a different kind of aura about you, you know. Um, at the moment you're closed off, you may not be ready for love because you're healing. But there will come a time when you will be ready and love will be waiting for you because I do see later on in the year that you have new love coming into you definitely new love coming in but you're not regardless of who it is you're not going to rush through that you're going to go with the flow take your time that's how you're going to deal with moving on you're not going to rush anything Let's get you out some angel answers. So, yeah, not the right time. So, yeah, it's not the right time right at this moment for you to be getting involved with anyone because it's important for you to heal that you have got in the near future, which back which backs this these cards up, that in the near future there will be a relationship for you quite helpful people so make sure you're getting the support you need there will be people that because you've got helpful people come up I feel that there will be a lot of support for you around you people that care about you people that will see help you through this meditate <laughs> you're going to start doing a form of meditation you're going to be doing something that helps helps you to realign realign your chakras you know re to get back in balance you know you've got recovery so yeah you are going to get this is going this this is all going to improve this situation you're going to recover from this going to bounce back of course <laughs> well, big happy changes are coming because there are big happy changes on the horizon for you no matter what I really these cards these angel answers really do clarify your main readings so remember keep going on keep 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 working on your healing because there is a new chapter a new episode in your life that will begin for you when you're ready so that was your reading please don't forget to drop me a like and subscribe and take care everyone i'll see you soon bye